When Douglas Collett found out he had early stage prostate cancer, he could have treated it with surgery or radiation. Instead, the retired construction worker kept tabs on the disease through tests and checkups, even though that went against his instincts. I've got to get rid of it, you know, that, that's, I think that's what all men feels anything to do with cancer. I think most people feel the same way. Collett participated in a major study which found that men with early prostate cancer who closely monitor it are just as likely to survive at least 10 years as those who have surgery or radiation. The results published Wednesday in the New England Journal of Medicine call into question which treatment is best and whether any treatment is needed for early stage cases. So there is an element of uncertainty when a cancer is found as to whether it's likely to cause harm or not. And there's new research which is really needed to be able to identify lethal from non-lethal disease. British researchers found a 99% survival rate at 10 years for men in this study with early prostate cancer. Still, some experts say it's hard to convince patients not to take drastic action, even though surgery and radiation can lead to urinary, bowel, or sexual problems. Those potential side effects concerned Collett, who was randomly chosen to track his condition during the decade-long study. I was fairly thankful that I got what I got, which was active monitoring. Today, Collett says he feels fine. Kathy Matheson, Associated Press.